It rolled the 6,200 and the 2,000 every day he came home from work and school. He was the CTA boogeyman, the rapid transit van, riding every day on the CTA. If I was the blue line, la 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 la, if I was the big line, thank you. Hey, check, check, check. Can we get a signal on this? Uh, I want to give a uh, computer. Thank Heidi and uh, Gail for coming out and supporting us. I want to thank the people, okay, my best friend Joe McMillan for coming out and supporting me. Give him a hand. I want to thank the, the ladies that took me to dinner tonight. I got enough food to last me for a couple days. I'm so glad right about that. Yeah. Get nothing from the two I gave you DIs, I believe. Uh, I gave you vegetables uh, since he's a vegan. Vegetables! Hey. He's a vegan, so give him a hand. Are we ready to get started now, Joe? I mean, uh, uh, I'm, I'm calling my boss, Joe. Are we ready to get started, Jonah? Ready, Jonah? Like I know. Two, five seconds. You better be ready. Okay. Um, I can uh, I can do some comedy for you. James Wolves, spaghetti and meatballs. What do you know? Uh, meatballs that only men have. Bowls between their penis. That's really weird spaghetti and meatballs. This is James Wool. And this is Tina St. Luke. They have hot water in Los Angeles. It's so polluted. And you can make a, a boiled egg with it. It stinks, David. It stinks. <laughs> Okay, are you ready now? Yep. Ready? I'm going to start with a song I wrote about the Chicago Northwestern. And this song is dedicated to Joe McMillan since he's a train buff like I am. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
another favorite railroad is the Erie Lackawanna. I love that railroad. I used to take it to family reunions in uh, Erie, Pennsylvania. I took it to family reunions in Pittsburgh. And I was, it was a beautiful train. And my ex-wife sold my train slip. So that's you know, Well, but anyway, I got a song about it. Here we go, Erie Lackawanna Railroad. to him. Even though he's dead, he was an artist, musician, and puppeteer like me. He was a puppeteer on the Garfield Goose Show from Chicago. He was the puppeteer on the Ray Rayner Show with Cuddly Dudley. So here's a song about Cookie. Cookie! Even though I died, I'm still alive. And I 
Betty White. She's from Chicago. She is from Oak Park, Illinois. She's one of us. Here's a song I wrote about Betty White. I get songs about my exes that dump me. Yeah. I used to date this Lutheran girl named Sonia Rood in the Lutheran church. She dumped me for her pastor. Then her pastor left her for another man. And she had a child as old as you. And so I wrote a song about it called No More Blues About Sonia Rood. No more blues of cops on your road. No more kind of love, someone that doesn't love you. No more blues of cops on your road. I forget all for you. You brothers and my reality. You better been the lady that was right for me. I bet you had hope, Luther and Church. I thought I'd overcome my own.
Did anybody get their boss before? No. And they gave you a raise? <laughs> I used to date this girl named Jill Fetcher. She was my boss and she yeah. worked at Comcast Cable. She gave me a raise. But as soon as she, uh, and then she jumped me for a guy who's oh, a Billy Goat, only to be a great great grandfather. So I wrote a song getting over her. Her name was Gail Fetcher. Gail Fetcher, Gail Fetcher, I like you. Just like Chicken and Cat, like Winnie the Pooh. You used to be my boss, too. You and the public access shows to Oh, Gail Fetcher, I like you. Now, Gail Fetcher, I like you. Now Gil Pesta, Gil Pesta, I like you. Just like Chicken the Cat likes winning a poo. You became me dead bowling together. You be my winning number for love forever. Now Gil Pesta, I like you. Now Gil Pesta, I want you. Now Gil Pesta, Gil Pesta, I like you. Just like Chicken the Cat likes winning a poo. You left me for another dude. Had me sad and I was singing the blues. But Gil Pesta, I bless you. But Gil Pesta, I release you. Now I used to date a woman named Fabian. And she jumped me for a jolly old English guy from England. And I wrote a song about this one. We got music with this. Oh, my God. 
me, they never loved me, they always need me, they never need me, they never need me, they never want me, they never want me. I travel the world doing music everywhere. Beautiful women come and take their photographs with me. Let the old home and leave me to me. Oh, 
school teacher. He was a skinny fly man and he didn't teach us just about the Bible. He taught us about the different aliens. This song is dedicated and then Colonel Janet at the, uh, the Pentagon, I wrote a TV show about it. It was supposed to be David Decker uh, classified but uh, uh, Tim Clinton, uh, changed it to Decker classified and gave it to Neil Hamburger. Can't win them all. Here's the song uh, New Technology. Say, I'm a holy and 
Former, I like to be an African American astronaut. Yeah. And this song is dedicated to all our astronauts that ever lived. Here we go. Hell yeah. Teleportation through space. Teleportation through space. My voice comes out of my face Woo! And it teleports to you The space, 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 space <laughs> The particles of me Create a wind of sound Crashing on the stronger air The technology we have Brings us here Together we can conquer anything Coast to coast. Here's the song called 
uh, give a warm uh, uh, announcing for Mr. Gray the Martian. There's a song I wrote about when I used to sell my portraits at La Brea Tar Pits. Uh, there was a presence that was watching over me, uh, and uh, and I wrote a song about this alien. We have a warm hand at Mr. Gray. Corinthians, go to the website Terracore, and I, um, uh, Tim and Eric wouldn't let me use the music I wrote, wrote for Cartoon Network, but you can't keep a good songwriter down. Yeah. I wrote a better version than what's on TV. Yeah. Here's the song that you all like, Salome.
And I was haunted by reptiles that were frogs. And I, um, I wrote a song about this experience. Here we go. Oh. I 
The people in the here that were vegetarians, oh. and they wanted me to do a song called "I Eat My Veggies," and here we go for all the vegetarians and people that eat right. I, I,